everyone, I am the Dragon Skull, and welcome back to Until Dawn, where we left off. We um, played around as Mike, and we followed the guy with the flamethrower and the, and the wolves back to his hideout. We snuck around in there, found some more totems and, and a lot of clues. Then we got chased by a wolf, but it turns out the wolf didn't want to kill us, it actually wanted to be our friend. So we befriended the wolf and gave it a bone. And so now we have a friend with us. And um, now we're playing as um, Matt again. I also looked through um, the bonus stuff here, and um, it turns out the whole um, trap thing, it was a trap, because if I did touch it, then um, it would my fingers would have been caught in a bear trap, and I would have to choose to either cut my fingers off or use the machete to get it out at the cost of breaking it. So it's a good thing I didn't touch that trap, because I knew it was a trap. And speaking of a trap, Matt and Emily seem to be in one right now because the killer seems to have ha to have locked them in. So let's um continue on and see what uh, what happens with them. Oh, didn't mean to go on that. There we go. Matt, up a cable car station. Yeah, the killer locked that. Hey, it's locked. The hell, who did that? The There's killer. Some seriously uncool shit going on up here tonight. Yep, it's been a while since I played as Matt, and I don't know what he and Emily are going to be doing, but hopefully they'll head back to the cabin where it's safe and join the others. Josh is dead. I can't believe how he died. No, I, I mean, what if they were wrong? What? Maybe we should have checked the shed to see if it was really true. I, I don't know. There are some things that once you see them, you can never unsee them. Yeah, I guess, but some things you have to see for yourself. I'll take them. Yeah, trust me, it was worth not seeing. After I saw it, I was grossed out and pretty much scarred. Because, look, This is why I don't watch horror movies, because I get squeamish when I see somebody's guts spilling out, or, or I'm seeing them sword in half like that. I just, ugh. Those are the things I can't stand looking at. Also, there's something here. Oh, it's a bucket of blood. It's still fresh. Oh, it's paint? I thought it was blood. Oh, I was hoping that would be a totem or something. Maybe there's some totems hidden around here. The totems have been very helpful to me in this game. Ah, here's, an, here's one. Alright, totem. What do, you, what do you bring for me now? Oh... It shows Matt falling to his death. Okay, so since I'm playing as well, I need to prevent that death from happening. There's a lot of deaths I need to prevent from happening now. I need to check on all the totems I've gathered so far and, and check each one of them so I can prevent the deaths of the characters. Look, an axe. Axe? Wait. Wasn't an axe... Wasn't an axe missing from a case when, at the beginning? That's the missing axe! What now? This is locked, Matt! We'll break the door down, will ya? Whoa, wait a second. If we start smashing shit down, he's gonna hear us. Well, you got any better suggestions? <sighs> I don't know. What about... Look! What? A window. <sighs> That's great, Matt. I can just about fit my lip balm through that little slot. <sighs> oh, come on. You will never fit through there, big guy. No, but you can. Help, help Emily through or smash the door. Uh, well, we never know what's in there. It might be a zombie or something. So I'm gonna help Emily through. I mean, she can fit, right? Right? I won't fit, but you will. Are you nuts? You're gonna shove my ass through that little hole? I've seen you sit in some pretty tight jeans, Em. Uh, excuse me? It's a talent. Fine, <laughs> let's do it. The way she said it just now. <laughs> If some of you are confused about what has happened, then you're obviously too young to understand. See? You can fit. What are you complaining about? Although I don't like her, I have to admit, that's not bad. See? What are you complaining about? You fit just fine. Oh my god. What? It's pitch black. I do not like this. I'm right here, Em. I can't see anything. There's so much crap in here. I keep bumping into. It's a 
okay. Uh, she's oh, really gosh. annoying me. Anything. Will you stop whining? Hard to be careful when it's freaking pitch black, you dead. Hey, I'm, I'm just trying to be helpful. Almost. Almost. I hope she turns out to be the killer. Because it would please me to kill her. Matt, seriously? Hey, sweetheart, you got the door open, what, I see. What the hell was that? I'm in the pitch black with spider webs and dust and ugh, you just go wandering off? Em, I just... Don't M me. This is a complete and total breakdown of even the slightest glimmer of trust I might have had that you can protect me from the bad things that are out here. And I am just majorly bumming out. Em, just stop. I'm really sorry. I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> well, see, you weren't thinking, for one thing. Matt, when this is all over... You need to break up with this girl. Happened. It's not worth it with her. We were here just a few hours ago. This must have just happened. What the fuck is going on? It's gotta what? be the guy, the the one who who got to Chris and Ash and Josh. He's gotta know this is the only way back. Don't say that. Look, I came the cars all the way up there. Well, that's I, I mean that's not far, right? You you can jump it. <laughs> I'm good, Em. Are you insane? Not that good. Flattered, though. Well, Matt, if you can't jump that, what are we gonna do? I, I don't know. You think because I'm a joke I can I make long like jumps? I think they knew exactly what they were doing. Uh, move, Emily! You're in the way. Yeah, man, when this is all over, you need to break up with this girl. It is not worth it. I can understand why Mike broke up with her. She is so annoying. Someone really did a number on this joint. Such a mess. This place was barely in working condition before, and now? It was a radio hey, tower. Fire tower. Where you call for help? Right. Maybe we should get the cable car working and take this show on the road, huh? What'd you call me just now? Magellan? What kind of name is that? That is a word I've never heard. Oh, move, Emily, you're blocking a light. There's something for me to pick up, and I want to There's see what it is. Something we can do. Oh, oh it's there. All this crap. There's gotta be something useful in here, right? Hmm. Can't activate any of the control. Oh! Wait. No keys, no cable car. Oh, never mind then. So, back to square one. <gasps> what about the fire tower on, on the map you found? Look, what about it? I guess it's an option. Oh, maybe it has a radio or something. I mean, it, it would, wouldn't it? Oh, I wonder what gave that away. Matt, we've got to get to that radio. We need that radio. Let's head back. I don't like Emily, but I, for once I'm actually agreeing with her on this one. We do need to call for help. Otherwise, we'll be trapped in this ma snowy mountain forever. We can use the radio to call for help. Somebody's Good butterfly it. effect. Oh, well, someone's learning to play by the rules. What? What rules? Rule number one, Emily is always right. Rule number two, nothing else matters because Emily is always right. Oh, shut up. I want to put this axe in your, your head. It's so bad. But I'm not going to do that because too many people have died. Plus, you Very friendly. I'll only kill you though if it turns out you're the killer. Just. Ugh. I really hate her. She's so annoying. Evan is always right, okay? You do, thi do things for me, Matt, because you're the dumb boyfriend. Why is he even going out with her? Is he hoping to get, some, get in on some action with her? Getting us out of here, Mr. Meat for Brains. Because it's not worth it. I don't care how hot she is. I don't, Emily may be hot, but she's not worth it, okay? There are plenty of fish in the sea. Why does zoom in on his face just now? Sure, just take your time. Can I climb down now? Look at this bad boy. You coming with me, buddy. Huh? Oh, you're torch. I thought you should talk like to the beat for a minute. Come on down. We can totally get out here this way. 
Okay, I need to shimmy now. Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. Shimmy, shimmy. Oh! Gotcha! You alright? Yeah! Uh, thanks, maybe um, you should go first to protect me. Oh, you bitch. Of course you'd say that. Okay. I swear, I'm having, okay, I'm having an urge to push you right now. Okay. Alright. Oh my gosh. The Almost. urge to push you off is Almost. too strong for me to resist. Don't look down. I still want to push her off now, okay. but I'm not gonna do that. Mostly because that's not known. That's not an option. God, that's over. Yeah, for real. I really hope she's the killer. I really hope it's her. I want it to be her now so badly. That way I can kill her without consequences. Oh, what's this? Another totem. It's a yellow one. Okay. What is yellow? Yellow means guided, so let's see what it's guiding me to. Oh, a flare gun! So, it's gonna, it shows Emily giving me a flare gun. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Hopefully she doesn't have an itchy trigger finger and she doesn't like pull and she doesn't shoot me with it. Emily, you better not do that, because if you do, if we are work. definitely done. The radio. It'll work. But... If it doesn't, we need a plan. Maybe we can just climb down. Climb down what? The mountain. Are you serious? That is stupid, Matt. It's, it's, it's not like it's floating in the sky. <laughs> it might as well be. It's pitch black out. Hey. Don't confuse it with Angel Island. You think the psychopath is just going to give up and run away? No. But maybe we should find a safe spot. Wait, what's back here? Yeah. Nothing. Okay. Figure this all out in the morning. As long as we don't hide in the lodge, that's where he expects us to go. The only way this mountain will be floating off ground is if there was, if it, is if the master emerald was hiding above there and Knuckles was guarding it. But no, this isn't Angel Island. This is Blackwood Mountain. I'm surprised I remember the name of this mountain. Oh, this does not look safe at all. This doesn't look safe. It's gonna break, isn't it? I just have a feeling it's gonna break. Oh, okay, maybe not. But can you blame me for having those feelings? I mean, in a horror game, these feelings are neutral. Wait, what's back here? Am I supposed to go this way, or...? No, I don't think I'm supposed to go this way, because Emily was heading down this wait what's this ooh hidden floorboards it's a photo what is this no it's a phone wait that's a Han and Beth's phone they, they came this way I remember they came through this way and that cliff that Emily was staring at that's the cliff where they fell and died whoa this is Phone. I thought the police like swept the whole area. Well, it looks like they missed this. That was that is a really good clue I found just now. Wait, so can I go this way? I can't. I didn't find any totems, but I found a, a clue about I found Beth's phone. I remember at the beginning of the game she dropped it and it fell down here when she and Hannah were running away from probably the monsters chasing them. And this cliff, right there, that's the the cliff they fell off and died. This is where they died. Ah, here's the totem. Good thing I went back and found the phone. Okay, that means good fortune. And it showed Chris and Ashley hiding from something. I heard a screeching noise, so it's definitely a monster. I don't think it's a zombie, because zombies don't screech. Oh, it's a full moon. Maybe the monsters are werewolves. And I just befriended a wolf. If I hit the wolf, maybe the wolf would have bitten me and then Mike would have become a werewolf. Oh boy, I'm so glad I didn't hit the wolf. Dan, Danger Cliff. That's what it says. Matt, given the choice, I prefer not to spend my evening plummeting to my death off of snowy cliff top. Yeah, you don't want to go the same way Hatter and Beth did.
Oh, it just lets me look at this, okay. So what, do I go back then? What's that noise? I don't know. What the? Tia! Oh god. Nice, Tia. I'm your friends. Don't hurt us. Oh god, this is turning into the ring too. Like that one scene where there were these deer and they attacked her. Oh, hello. Yeah, they attacked on the car. I forgot about Sam. Why is she listening to classical music in the in the hot tub? Oh god, the killer's there watching her. Enjoying the show, freak? You love seeing naked girls taking a bath while listening to music on their phone? Hello? I've forgotten about Guys. Sam. It's been a while since I've seen her. What are you doing out there? Nothing. Creepy. More like they're being creeped on. Okay. Oh, are you gonna... Uh... Oh, this is not showing me anything. Well, that's actually a good thing, because if it did, that means I'd have to censor it. And I am not in that, that part of YouTube where I know how to censor stuff. Sam, Washington Lodge. I like what I see. I like it a lot. Give us a turn. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Nice junk in the trunk. <laughs> okay, that's a reference I just did right there. I'm not actually perving. That was a Nomeo and Julia reference I just did. That before people start going crazy in the comments. Pete's sakes, my clothes, really? Oh, they took Everybody my clothes. Did this is off my Christmas list. Seriously, not cool, guys. Not cool at all. They just took my clothes away, aw. Oh. Classic prank. Where they just take away my clothes and I have to be in a towel. Oh. Ah. Classic. Alright, let's head out then. I guess we're not wearing... Oh, wait. no, I didn't mean to click that. I meant to click the door. Right, can I put this down now? I want to get out. I didn't mean to click that. I meant to click on the door. Guess I'm going out with no clothes on then. Yeah, this? A, this is definitely fan service right Gosh. here. <laughs> the developers thought, hmm, let's have um, Sam be in a towel for the remain for the the remaining time of this game. That'll definitely please them um, fans. <laughs> and then they're like, no, we're just we're kidding. We're just gonna have her in a towel so you can't see anything. <laughs> Whoa! I was about to say that. Damn, she has some nice legs too. Wait, why is there a balloon? I swear there wasn't a balloon Mom, here last Emily? time. They're this all gone. This is really getting out of hand, okay? It was all very funny, haha. -ha. Look at What's Sam it? walking around in a towel, but now I just really want this to be over, all right? You had enough? Nope, and neither is the killer. <laughs> Also, I really hope the killer doesn't, well, you know. I really don't want any scenes like that. It would make it uncomfortable. Plus, um, some of you guys who have watched my videos are, are kids. Can I have my clothes back now, or am I supposed to hang out in a towel for the rest of the weekend? Uh, probably the second option, Sam. <laughs> yep. <laughs> like, like I said, you're going to have to be in a towel. And for once, your friends aren't doing this. The killer is. Yeah, I, that balloon wasn't there before. It has an arrow on it. It's pointing here, so it's telling me to go this way because that's what the killer wants. Uh, no, don't go this way. Don't go this way. Hi. Sorry, I wasn't looking at your comments. I was too busy with the game. Huh? So there's a totem you didn't find that I found. Nice. Ready for the scene? Oh, I've already read this. I've already read this before in the previous episode. Where do I go? Picking something up. <laughs> huh. 
<laughs> I feel bad for poor Sam. She's probably gonna spend the rest of this game in a towel. Freak me out. Guess what? You succeeded. Yeah, except your friends aren't trying to freak you out. You're uh, the killer is. I can't stop looking at her. The developers um and and real are really trying to. You know, you know. They really want um, the, this fan service to oh, work. Oh, hi! I guess I'm not the only one who's um, hey, who's interested in Sam. Guys, come on! Oh, I'm that came out wrong. With this. I really don't appreciate the silent treatment here. <laughs> oh god, the killer's striking. Hello, Samantha. Hello, psycho killer. You enjoyed the view? I don't think you'll have much luck by looking, Samantha. You're only going to see what I want you to see. And I have quite a lot to show you. What is going on? Open your eyes. Oh my god. He's been videoing this. She's quite beautiful, isn't she? Why are you doing out there? A beautiful bathing bird. Do you think she has any idea what lies ahead? Do you think these were the last happy moments of this creature's Why life? Showing this to me. Why are you watching? That's a good question, actually. Josh! Why does it make you feel? Oh. Oh. Why? Do? I'm going to give you ten seconds. Oh god. Nine, no. Eight, no, 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 no! Seven. Oh jeez! Hi! Sam. Hi! Hi Psycho! I'm gonna uh, run! I'm not gonna throw a vase because I don't have the time for that! Oh god he's holding something! Okay uh, what do I do? Jo uh, uh, jump! I'm not, I don't have time to hide! The killer's gonna find me! I mean, come on, under the bed, that's the obvious hiding place! I've seen horror movies, so I know how these things work. Whoa! That would have been bad. Could have broken her foot, her toe or something. Oh, and now what? Uh, run! Hiding isn't gonna work. Oh, he's moving slow. Oh, great. Are you kidding me? No handle? Okay, now I should hide. Uh, pull. Okay, maybe that's a bad idea. Or maybe not. Okay, that was good. That was good. Oh, jeez. Run. Oh, look it. Close. Okay, I need to get out of here. I think Totems is the least of my problems right now. So I'm just gonna go. Whoa! Okay, that was bad. Oh, she's gonna be really dirty after this, and she's gonna have to take another bath. I do not like the look of this hallway. So it's gonna zoom past my screen, isn't it? Okay, maybe not. Oh, crossroads. Uh, 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 hide. Let's try hiding this time. Or maybe I should have run. Oh god, is there another one of these? Oh, this is hard to do, the holding still thing. It's really hard to do. I have very shaky hands, so it's hard for me to do this. Also, what he just said here, pussy pussy, were you referring to the cat or the other thing? Well, that certainly didn't go according to plan, now did it? 
The office is back to normal. Such careful, brilliant plotting, and yet in a crucial moment you are foiled by your own inadequacies. I told you, everything you do has consequences. You think this mistake won't have repercussions? What you do and what you say causes things to change. Oh, the good work we did exploring the source of your fear. And you've just gone and used it for ill. Mm -hmm. Your overwhelming fear of isolation. You've turned it against these people who use it desperately to avoid torment. Has it been worth it? So he was interviewing the killer this whole time. The psychiatrist was, was um, interviewing the killer. But who is it? What are you talking about? Oh my god, we gotta get out of here. I don't understand what happened. There's a maniac. This is insane. We need to go get some help. Hello? Guys? Who is the killer? Hopefully we'll find me. out in this episode. We should look for the others. Mike and Jess are off 69ing each other and who knows where Sam is. I think she's in the lodge. Why are we still talking about this? Let's go! Hey look! Fire tower. <laughs> Matt, what is that? I don't know. <gasps> it's Thea, honey. It's Thea. And they probably want to kill us. Six, psychosis, five hours until dawn. What okay, we're halfway through this game what are you now. Calm. Let's be calm. Stay calm. Relax. They're just deer. They just want to check us out as all. Well. No, 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 Matt. They're gonna hurt us. They won't hurt. They won't attack if we attack first. So let's just be calm about it. Easy, easy, I'm not gonna hurt you. Just let us through, okay? Good deer, good deer. There's a good deer. I don't wanna hurt you. I'm not gonna hurt you with the axe, I promise. I'm your friend. I mean, I know I'd be friend of the wolf, but I can be friend deer as well. No, no, I'm not doing anything. I'm not doing anything. Just walk slow. It's okay. Come on. There. It's okay. If I attacked the deer, that would have been bad. There you go. Good deer. I'm not going to stroke them because they might lash out. Phew. That was close. Okay, I still have some time before this episode ends. Oh, I'm playing as Emily now. Ah, great. Playing as the person I hate. Okay. I don't know where we're going, if but we hopefully to, the... to get someone on the radio. We will. Then we tell them we need help. What do we do while we wait? We go back to the lodge. And get um. Else. Oh God. Yeah, that's not good the too. Lodge. We should stay here in case whoever it is needs to get back in touch with us. Let's get that radio working first. Do us a favor though, when you do get rescued, don't ever come to this place again. You hear me? Never come back. Leave here for for good. Oh, that's freaking bright. No kidding. I yeah. can't see. What is that? It's just a security light. Motion sensor, probably. That's it. That light is brighter than your future, Emily. <laughs> Another totem. All right, let's see what this one has to offer. Oh, it shows Emily and Chris, no, Ashley and, Cr and Chris with a gun. And Chris just put it on the table, so maybe that's what I need to do. I think the yellow is telling me that I need to do things. So later on, if I get a flare gun as Emily, I need to give it to Matt. Maybe so he can defend himself with it. And later on as Chris, when he's holding a gun, maybe I need to not shoot anyone with it. 
Why would I shoot anyone anyway? Unless the killer is forcing me to either kill Chris or Ashley or something, I don't know. Like he did it before with Josh. Maybe that time, is for, um, next time that happens, I'm, I need to do nothing. Then no one else will die. Luckily for me though, Josh dying doesn't affect the true ending of this of this game. I really want to save everyone. If if someone dies because of me, I'm gonna be really annoyed. And yes, that does include Emily. As much as I hate her, even she doesn't deserve to die. Oh god, who's that? Oh, it's Matt. Don't do that, Matt. Also, why would you leave the axe there? Take it with you in case we run into anything. I do not like this tower. It looks rusty and damaged. And it, and it looks like it's gonna fall. Why is it so windy all of a sudden? We're almost inside. Well, we are going higher and higher into, into the atmosphere, so that's why. I mean, have you ever tried um, climbing the Empire State Building at night? Because it's very freezing up there. It's so cold you could lose your grip and you could fall. I've never done it, but um, I've looked it up. Plus it was mentioned in the Doctor Who episode once. Get climbing, Emily. Alright, we're inside. I had something in my throat just now. There we go, we're safe. For now, at least. Yeah. Okay, let's have a look around then, shall we? Let's start by looking in here. 